Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. Let's be honest, for years, most of us have been juggling multiple apps for our music, one for our local files, another for streaming, maybe a third for YouTube music videos. It's a mess. But what if I told you there's one app that aims to do it all, beautifully and with an insane amount of features? Today, we're taking a deep dive into Namida. Built with Flutter, it's a stunningly beautiful and feature-rich music and video player with full YouTube support, and it might just be the last music app you'll ever eat. First, let's talk about the foundation. Namida isn't just a pretty face, it's a library powerhouse. The indexing is incredibly powerful, powered by JAudimo tagger, meaning it handles your tags perfectly. It intelligently separates main artists from featured artists, prevents duplicate tracks from cluttering your library, and even lets you set minimum file sizes and durations to ignore things like ringtones or voice notes. You get a complete folders-based library system with the ability to exclude any folder you want. And sorting? You can sort by almost any property of a track or album you can think of. It's all about giving you total control over your collection. Now, let's talk about how it looks. Namita uses a modern Material 3-like theme that's clean and responsive. But the killer feature here is dynamic theming. The entire player's color palette is picked directly from the current album artwork, making every song a unique visual experience. It's absolutely gorgeous. Paired with this slick waveform seek bar, it just feels alive. All right, this is where Namita truly separates itself from the pack, its YouTube integration. This isn't just a tacked on feature, it's a core part of the experience. You can stream in the best possible video and audio quality or switch to an efficient audio only mode to save data, but it gets better. You can download, cache, and play your favorite YouTube tracks completely offline. And for the power users, you can edit tags for your downloads before they even start. It can even automatically extract the title, artist, and album for you. There's even a file name builder, similar to what you'd find in YTDLP, for ultimate organization. The built-in video player is also fantastic, with full gesture support for controlling volume, seeking, and entering full screen. And that's the main takeaway with Namita. It's a player built for people who truly love their music and want control. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.